Good evening my Stitchy family and welcome to my channel Stitcherella. Today is Thursday, that means Ambi Light Thursdays. Uh, I had quite a hectic day, it was busy. My mom is here, say hello mom. Hello Yola. She says hello to everybody. She's hot. She's busy with that um, nine count. She's loving it. And guess what? She is not using the wax. She is doing it without wax. So next time I'm gonna. But I, I, I work fast and I, I don't want it to cook. Cook means um, make knots and stuff. So I'll see if I can do it. Oh, so she says I must just hold it right. But my mom is doing. The silk without beeswax. And she likes it like that. She likes it more like that. So next time I'm going to try it again because I feel foolish. My mom comes in here and I teach her nicely with the beeswax. And when I saw again, she's not using the beeswax. She's going on strong without it. She loves it. So yay, kudos to mom. We the mommy had not been so And um... What happened here today is we slept. Uh, Alex had to go to take the x-rays and sonos today. Couldn't wait till tomorrow. His leg is not right. So he went and we waited for the results. His dad phoned earlier and he said, all right, we he must stay off the leg. But um, next week he's, he must go and see a... Uh, mommy... What what it what's the being doctor in um, Engels? An orthopedic. As an orthopedic specialist, he must go and see one like that. So yeah, and then Alex had a chat with me. He does not want to play cricket anymore. That just broke my heart. But I'm not going to force my kids to do something. I saw the last two weeks was a hassle to get him there. I was like begging him, and he was begging not to go, and he just. He, he wasn't motivated to go at all, and I made him go, and look what happened now. But he spoke to me, and he wants to, he'll decide what he's going to do, but he doesn't want to play cricket anymore. He's going to do some gymming, and uh, they've got a gym at a school, but I don't want to force him. My heart's very sore because of it, but you can't force a kid to do something when they've, they've done it, and they just don't want to do it anymore, so I'm not going to force him. So that happened, and then we got home, and me and mom were having chats, and I was running up and down, and I decided not to do unboxings today, and surprise, surprise, you guys know I did too, right? <laughs> so yeah, two unboxings up, they are going strong, I just love those Joy Sundays, they are freaking amazing. That uh, GBFKE, that canvas storage envelope or whatever you may call it the a3 my dear stitchy family the a3 is big enough you guys know how big that um birth of baby jesus is it was joy sunday with all the threads i fit that in there and there is space for more so they are quite nice for big projects i must say very very nice for big projects so my baby Jesus project is in there. So we'll stitch on that one tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow, me and mom have a big day plan. Sounds yeah, we'll picky, mom. All right. So what she said, we're going to town and we're gonna buy stuff. I'm buying nothing. She means she's buying stuff. Because I'm taking her to do some of her shopping and she wants to go to a clothing store. So I'm taking mom to town tomorrow morning. And she says, oh, she's a stitchy. She finally got something. It's the first time she's been stitching. But, you know, it's not like uh, me, like stitching. Stitch. And finally, she's addicted to a stitch. So she's got that stitchy bug where she does not want to stop stitching. It's, it's amazing. I love it. And she forgot to tell you something else. What can we tomorrow morning do, Ma? Cookies box. Ah, so members, did you hear that? If you're from South Africa, you will understand that. But she said, we're going to do the cookies. So we're going to town in the morning. 
And we're doing the members video in the afternoon. We are doing the Herzogis. Today was just too crazy, but tomorrow definitely. So we're doing that and then in between or after I'll do the Christmas stitch along. So no unboxings tomorrow, guys, because it's a full day. I'm going to do a proper stitch along and then for the members we're going to bake those cookies. My kitchen's layout is not so great so that you can see exactly. So I'm going to um, set the camera up but it's not going to stay in one place. I'll take it off and show you the progress and you'll see us and then you won't see us. So I'll, I'll change it around so that everything is, is done. Abby is still not better. She she's not she's not well, but I can't I, I don't want to speak about that over air. So, yeah, that's a bit private. I'm not speaking about that. So um, my dad booked her off tomorrow as well, so we'll see how that goes. They must manage the problem. And yeah, so yes, what a week. Oh my soul. But my mom's here and that makes everything better. Uh, tonight I made us some chicken and chips and salad. So we had chicken, chips and salad. Too much food. <laughs> My mom said she got so much food that she just want to sleep. But I gave her only a piece of chicken and chips. <laughs> she ate a bit of salad. So it's not that much, but, but normally she eats little. But... Um, at their house, my, my brother and his wife cooks and they don't eat starch, so they don't make potatoes. And my mom's been missing that. And um, I made that. And of course, she's going to feel a bit tired and filled up with all the starch I'm feeding her. Because uh, starch is not very expensive, so we eat starch. Of course, we eat starch. Salad's more expensive than potatoes, so yeah. <laughs> If you make a nice fancy salad, it's more expensive than potatoes. Yes. So she is on the go again with a nine count there. We haven't watched one movie really because we're talking and talking and talking. We've got the TV on, but we lose track. We just put it on anything in the background and we chat and talk and we do things. So we can't really follow something. We're too busy talking and carrying on but I'm loving it I really really love it the kids are in their rooms again it is cold people very cold I did take a, a take I show it for the first time in ages you guys know I bath I love bathing but this morning um, before I had got before I knew I was planning to bath early, but I didn't because then I had to take Alex. So I jumped in the shower quickly. How unpleasant is it to shower in the winter? Oh my gosh. Um, this camera is giving you seasickness. I'm sorry if it moves a bit. Okay, wait, we're going to have to do something about this. Just hold on, everybody. This is a problem. Sorry. Uh, this thing is moving too much. Okay, so let's see if that goes better. I've, I've tightened it up a bit because the other side of this is bumping it. Then goes wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Yeah, so how unpleasant is it to shower? Oh, my soul. I was freezing. I get in the water, then it's too hot, then it's too cold. Then it's too hot and I couldn't get it right. And when you get out the shower, you don't even feel like it because it's freezing. No, thank you. My mom just laughs at me. I like to bath. When I get out of the bath, I'm nice and warm. So, yeah, that happened. That won't happen soon again, not in winter. That's, that's just too cold. Oh, no. I don't know how Alex does it. He loves showering. He doesn't like bathing. He loves to shower. He showers a few times a day. Abby, Abby baths. Abby baths with me. Not with me. Um, you know what I mean. I've told you before. She baths. We bath together in each other's water. That's what we do. Because we don't have a lot of water, or she baths and I bath in her water, or I bath and she baths in my water, and it's nice and all. Then we don't have to wait. It's not always, but most of the times. That came out wrong. Mommy, I can don't need say I can have you bath song. That that was forget. I'm telling my mom what I just said. She's just laughing. 
because no, not together, in each other's water. And no, when the one is very dirty, we won't do that. But we don't get very dirty. It's not like we do construction work or it's summer. In summer, you, it's different. But yeah, it's icy cold and everyone's still clean by the time we do <laughs> we bath. I just bath to get warm again and freezy. But yes, kids, kids, kids. And mom is here. Um... I'm taking, I must take one of my mom's friends to uh, a station on Sunday. So I'll do it with the kids in the car and my mom. Because Mike is not here. Mike is not here Sunday. His work is picking him up. Or the people at work, they going to do a, a fun walk. I almost said run. We'll see how Mike runs. He can't run anymore. He will roll around there now. So he, they're doing it. <laughs> Fud mommy. <laughs> Yo, how is he going to run? That's not happening. So he's going to walk. It's a walk for cancer or something like that. But the whole... What's wrong? I'm recording. Uh, I'm, I'm joking around with Alex and I forgot to record it. It sounds like you're getting murdered. Okay, yeah, so he's going there. So Sunday he's not here. And yeah, that's about it. Lola still... Oh, I haven't given her medicine talking about that. Lola, but she's lying here. Yeah, Lola, I'll tell them now. But um, yeah, she she's still no attacks, which I'm very grateful for. And my mom says Lola's very glad she's here, but she is. That's why she's sleeping here on the corner of the bed. So I haven't, I didn't wake her up for medicine. I'll wake her up when I take a break here. Yeah, I'll wake her up quickly and give her medicine. But you guys must see how cute this is. It's the cutest thing you have ever seen. Now this morning I slept and as I woke up, my mom walked into the room. Uh, to come and take a seat here with me and we had coffee but when Lola realized mom is in the room she jumps up and she looks and she runs to my mom to my mom and she was just, it was the cutest thing she just jumped up and looked and she saw my mom and she ran to her to say hello it's the cutest it's like cutest thing <laughs> and my mom said and sit up my squid it means um, and sat on her lap so yes it's very cute very very cute it's like she's got a new life now that a problem is not there it's it's weird how life-changing it is for them when you fix the problem they're having it is life-changing i can see it in her attitude and i think you guys can see it even because she does not leave my side not even when i record she was on both unboxings today and um it's not because I put her there, she comes and sits wherever I am, and when I put that light on, she wants to be in the action. She does not want to sit next to me, she wants to sit in the spotlight, so I just leave her. My little Lola, she's so beautiful, I don't know what I'll do without her. Oh, I love her so much, you you know, you can, I love all my pets, but the, Lola's just different. I can't believe the amount of love I have for her, it's very, very cute, she's so cute. But she loves her mommy too. She she comes with her nose and then she bumps my head and she rubs her head against my my cheek. It's very, 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 very cute. I just adore her. And I just checked my internet speed. I promise you guys there's nothing wrong with it. I do not know why the video since a day ago takes so long to load. At least I get them up, but still. It's still a pain where people not it's not supposed to have pains. Where was that? What was that? Is that my phone? Yeah, it's my phone. That, what's that? We're hearing voices, noises. What's that? It might work. I don't know. Okay, so we are hearing stuff. And I, my mom's asking if it's a phone. It's not. The phone's lying next to me charging. Just hold on, guys. Abby! Yeah. What are you doing? Oh, 
did, do you have your end porn? Yes, and I'm just doing it wrong. Oh, but be nice. Go, go I'm help trying, him. I'm trying, but he did a frame master of puppets. He played Queen of Dolls. Oh, <laughs> go help him nicely. You can put the amp on. Mommy just wanted to know what was that. Okay, guys. Phew, what? It was a weird way, and I'm not used to it. Not this time, and I'm... She's trying to teach her brother how to play guitar. She's got good lessons. She's loving it. But the problem here now is I'm having that... Um, and I can't do it right now. Her brother wants a bass guitar, so... Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I, I don't know. They want to make a band and they want to do this. But now she's helping him what she learns to play on the guitar. She's teaching to to Alex. Very cute. So it's the amp. They plugged in the electric guitar into the amp. And that's what made the noise. But they did it like not the loud, loud noise that I'm used to. It was much softer and weirder. And that's why I asked my mom, do you hear that? She's like, no, isn't it my phone? I'm like, no. And then it happened again and my mom's eyes went big and we're like, no, what's that? <laughs> Abby, yeah. play a loud tune quickly. We're play a loud tune, I want to hear. Yeah. Now she doesn't want to. I think it's, I think it's loud more. My mom's asking her to please play something, but that thing, my mom does not realize how loud that electric guitar is noisy. But I'm so proud of her. Abby is... Where mom? Where mom? Hiding her ass. Okay, so she is playing her first... Um, they call it a showcase. She's playing in September. I'm very, very excited. I'm going to go and look. Alex, I'm recording now. Alex, I'm recording. Don't sing. He's, he's trying to sing something, but he's being weird. He, so he sings beans, beans, beans. I don't know what. They probably see, saw some weird TikTok thing that's called beans. Now they're trying to reproduce it. I don't know. Mama moet eindelijk op zo'n gaan kijken wat jou gel aan. Dat is baie cute as hulle so saamspeel. Right. Telling my mom to go and look, but she said she's not going to get up and knees are hurting. So now then she must just sit. Don't get hurt. We are having fun. No more hurting, no more nothing in this house. Enough is enough. Enough. I'm telling you guys, enough. <laughs> yeah. Oh well. Put another one in. I love it. You know, um, Abby and Alex, they love each other. They really, really do. But man, now that they are teenagers, Abby is a teenager in a few months. And not, it's next year, but it's January, so it's a few months. Um, they bicker. So times like this, where they actually sit in one room and play and stuff, I appreciate so, so much. When they were younger, they did not bicker so much. But now, oh my gosh. But don't let someone hurt one of them. Then the other one is there to help the other one out. It's actually very sweet, right? I think so. I don't know. Oops. Right, so let's get the... Uh I didn't stitch a lot. Every time I want to stitch, things comes up. But I will finish this very soon. You guys must not worry. Just look out. I'll keep you up to date. You know that. This is not a lot of stitching left to do. Busy with the red tree. Let's get the red tree done. Then there's a few holes on the bottom I must fix. Uh, just on the corner. And we're done. Not so much. We are like taking the last stride here. I know from this side looks a lot, but it's just because nothing's stitched here. 
it will go quick quick next Thursday you'll see what it looks like it will look very close to finish that I guarantee you these are not that difficult let me see where am I gonna go now oh where am I gonna go now all right let's go there it's a big old jump but I've got enough threads I know that I've checked it so it's all right we can jump and make our cross country a, a real thing yeah Monoclog uh, stitch. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Rest Oh my word! <laughs> <laughs> Says my food's making us sleep. It's better not sleep. <laughs> yeah. Oh, let's see what's going on. It was very lucky. Oh, it's a great pleasure, mommy. I can't even remember precisely what was more than eight. We were going to slide. Okay. Uh, yeah, my mom says well, I gave her food, it makes her sleep. I just said to her because I had this whole menu planned and blah blah blah. But tomorrow's Friday, so we'll see. It's not a. Uh, Mike is making stir fry or I don't know, chicken stir fry or something else. I don't know. We're not 100% sure yet. We'll see how the mood is tomorrow. So I'm just. Mommy, very really sloppy. I'm not going to with water. I don't know what you're Yeah! Yeah, mommy, you Oh my gosh, you guys know, a while ago, um, okay, first let me tell you what my mom just said. I said to her, she better not fall asleep, I'm going to pour water on her. I won't really do that, that's rude. But um, a while ago, I, must, <laughs> I was making. I was actually recording a video for a store, not like this, for a store. And I started laughing, but <laughs> um, while I'm recording, she fell asleep and she started snoring, but so loud. And the louder she snores, the louder I speak. <laughs> that was such a funny, I don't even know which one it was. But I start laughing while I do the video. I'm almost finished. I'm not going to start over. So I just start laughing and go louder, louder. Because my mom goes... <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was so funny. It was very, very funny. I think I talked her asleep. I talked and she listened to me and she fell asleep. <laughs> <coughs> oh my soul alright yeah funny times good times good memories guys good memories alrighty then let's just go here just gonna go down as well I will probably finish this red circles tonight. Oh, I'm so close to finishing them. So, yeah. If I go down this color, it's almost totally done. It's all this dark red. Okay, remember there's three prints. So don't go and compare yours if it's not the same print. But this maroon red circles, I'm working them. But I'm almost done with everything. That's why I say... Goal for tonight, before I go to sleep, will be to finish all of them and maybe start with the light blue. We'll see how that goes. But tomorrow there's not going to be ambi lighting because I'm going to take mom to town. And mom promised Abby slippers, so she's so excited. She's driving my mom nuts about it. And when we come back, probably just take a break, take a breather, drink a coffee. Then bake cookies and after cookies make dinner. I don't make the dinner but eat dinner. Wait for Mike to make the dinner. Let's say it like that. And then I will do the birth of baby Jesus. Stitch along. Yeah, the Christmas one. So we'll do that one. I really think the birth of baby Jesus I must start doing on its own and under the Christmas one do the sock but I will see how it goes we will just see alright 
because I must do the sock a bit as well. But a lot of people are doing baby Jesus with me. So tomorrow it will be baby Jesus definitely. So don't stress out about that. Those two are having fun. I'm getting quiet because I'm listening to Abby and Alex. And they are having fun. So she probably... Sitting in his room, she took his, the bass, her guitar probably to his room, or he took the crutches and sitting in her room, and they are having a ball, and I can hear them giggling and singing like dragons. <laughs> Just having fun, right? Alrighty then, I'm going to give um, Lola medicine quick. I will be back in a jiffy. Alrighty then, let's do this. My mom, um, I helped, I, okay, let's start at the beginning, ding, ding, ding. I helped, did I help Alex? No, of no, no, ma, wanneer te kom gau? But in anyway, no, no. I helped him earlier. Then I gave Lola medicine and then Lola wanted to eat. And then I answered my phone quickly. And then I helped my mom quickly. <laughs> Just quick, quick. Uh, she is on the go with that nine count silk again. She's just loving it. And it's coming out so beautiful. We are, mommy, I love mommy, it's a progress in. Yeah, but we'll post it on the group or what it's just more for her. I just told her because a lot of you guys want to see her progress. She is on our Facebook group, guys, but she never posts there, so she must post it. So she says she will. She's working, it, it's coming out nice. I'm in the mood to get another one like that for myself. But I've got so many that I'm working. It's just pretty. But anyway, I decided to give that one and the Van Gogh to my mom because she loves it so much. Um, yeah, she's enjoying it. So let her go on with it. Um, what else is there? That, that's basically what happened. And now I'm back. So we are going to watch a bit of American Horror Story Season 10. Yeah, we're going to start Season 10. I've watched some of the seasons. When it get, gets too gross or too weird, then we switch it off. <laughs> but, <laughs> yeah, mommy. Well, what's your mom? Say it again. I say, so net will the horror kijk. En ek moet alleen slaap. Ek is bang as ek die ding klaar gekijk. Alright. So, she's, my mom says, I want to watch all the horrors, but then she must go and sleep alone in her room, and she's scared when she's finished watching them. But now, guys, she chooses to sleep alone in the room. She, <laughs> she can sleep here by me if she wants, but she does, she likes to sleep in her own bed. So, no, 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 no. And she likes horrors. We always laugh. I love watching horrors around mom. I'm not scared of the actual horror. I get scared because of the screaming of mom. That It's classic, guys. It is classic. When all of us are together, all of the children, all of my mom's kids, then we put on a horror and then we all sit and wait for my mom to yell. <laughs> <laughs> it is classic. I love it. It is amazing. Oh, la la. Oh, she's so super cold. So I gave her medicine. She wanted to eat. And now she's shifted up. But, um, what, what do you mean to dice and put, mommy? A what? A dice and put. A shongololo. What, what do you mean to shongololo? Oh, um, okay. Uh, I'm gonna have to Google it. I'm asking my mom. What do you call it? I'm the recording. Um, the uh, I'm asking my mom. What do you call a shongololo? In English, in Afrikaans, it's a decent poet because she's curled up like one. Google mod it. <laughs> okay, my mom's googling it, so I don't have to google it, so we must just be patient. Yeah, she she's curled up like a shongololo. Oh, she's very cute. Now I can see she's cold. I must close her. But she first sat on my legs, but it's extremely uncomfortable the way I'm positioned here at the moment. Uh, centipede. A centipede. Yeah. 
It's mommy a decent put a centipede. No centipedes are those flipping ugly things. Who is that centipede? Centip oh my god. Sorry guys. Wait, I must just because centipedes are lilac things. Decent so just hold on. A clumark, weird. Decent put is a centipede. Okay, but okay. We call uh, a Dacent poet, but it's a centipede, so it's probably a type of centipede. Because the ugly centipede that's poisonous, that's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about the Dacent poet, the Shongololo. It's a black one. We get them here everywhere, even but mostly when it rains. You get a lot of them. And they've got fine black legs and they're long black thing. Not that ugly, big centipede things. That's, that's not what I'm talking about. But we call them Shongololos. But she's curled up like one, and she's so super cute, and she's black, so she's a Shongololo tonight. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, after this video, I'm just going to get dressed super warm, because I had a shower that made me absolutely not warm. Um, but I'm not going to bath now. Alex had a long shower, so if I want to bath now, I'm going to bath in a freezing bath. So gonna dress warmer, get this video on, and then me and mom's gonna watch horrors. I'm gonna listen to a scream. <laughs> hey, mommy? Yeah. But she likes horrors. I got my horror watching from my mom. I kijk altijd horrors. And as I go by my flat is, but you see no art of andere is a <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my gosh okay so what's happening here is my mom before my dad passed away my brother had a house in front of my mom and dad so my dad sold my brother sold his house he bought my dad's house and my dad to the money built Andre's house which was his house bigger with a whole flat on the side, but it's attached to my brother's house. Now, what happens is, she says, this is what she says. I just had to explain the logistics there to you. So, she's saying what happens is, she loves watching horrors on her own in her flat. But, when she gets scared, scared she still yells. She can't help it. Then my brother runs from his house because it's attached with a washing room runs from his house to her house because he thinks she's getting attacked. <laughs> I'll probably do exactly the same bloody thing. You guys have never heard her scream uh, for horrors. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's, it's, a, it's a natural thing that, 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 you, that mommy does. It's weird to talk to her in English because uh, Afrikaans people... Don't call their mother and father you. We don't say, okay, in Afrikaans it's yay and yo. So Afrikaans people, um, I don't say you to my mother. That is the extreme. It's it's rude. English people don't mind. But um, in Afrikaans, if we say that, it's, I still now tell Abby and Alex, yes, and if my yay and yo ni. So it's extreme, extreme rude thing to to. To, to address your parents as you in Afrikaans. So I don't like speaking Afrikaans to my mom because it doesn't make sense when I speak English because I ref you can't say you to her. It, it's rude. You can't do that. It doesn't matter which sentence in Afrikaans that doesn't happen. I would have gotten a slap if I was younger when it was still legal <laughs> to slap your children. <laughs> No, my mom, my mom was cool. Yeah, no, that is a total no-go for us. We're not allowed to. And we also, in Afrikaans culture, we do not address, if someone's 10 years older than us, we say, Tani and Wim. It's uncle and auntie, you have to. Unless they tell you not to call them, and the other Afrikaans person, unless... They tell you not to do so. So you you must say Tani and um, Auntie and Uncle. And then um now 
now for me with the English overseas people stuff, it's a bit different. I can't anti everyone. They will think it's very, very um, <laughs> unprofessional of me. And sometimes it's super, super uncomfortable because I got brought up. If someone's 10 years older than you and you don't say auntie and um, there will be a big hiding waiting for you when we get home. So that's how we grew up. We grew up very strict with morals and manners. Very, very strict. Uh, just hold on, guys. Yeah, Pop? Uh, when you're done recording, just check your phone quickly. I sent you some messages. Uh, did you... Uh, must I look now? Mm, after you record. Okay, I'll look. Um, I'll, I'll look afterwards. I'm just talking to you. I said... Uh, uh, okay, baby. Thank you. Okay, she's just... You guys heard. It was Abby. She's telling me that she sent me something. I know I'm nosy. Let's let's look now. If it's rude, I'm not going to tell you. But she's not allowed to send me rude things. Okay, let's see what I got. Oh jeez, just hold on. Okay, so what's this? Abby, yes. Abby, come here. Come here. Yo. Yeah. Abby, yo. Yeah. Okay. Do you I want it? Please. Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh. What is it? Oh my gosh. Okay, I'll tell you guys now. Um, Ronald and David cook for a normal guitar work. This fantastic. Wow. Okay, so she, um, oh my gosh, but they must do something for Alex too. Um, okay, so her dad and his wife is getting her a normal guitar as well. How cool is that? So she's just showing me. They ask her if she'll be interested in that. And, um, oh wow. And she came to ask me, basically, if she can say yes. It was very cute. She can say yes, of course. It's beautiful present. So, yeah, she's getting a normal guitar as well. She's got the, she's got the electric and then she's got the normal. Wow, that's amazing. I wonder if... This is cool, Emma. Fantastic. Yeah, that's very cool. I don't know if I'm going to I said, but now he's beginning, but she can't say, say, come, say, no, he, but she, but now, last year, she said, September, then she said, a full week, she can play. Yeah, so then, then she could say, she was a bit, but a little over now. So I, I pressure her not to play, she will play, she will play, she will play. Oh wow, guys, that is awesome. My mom says, does she play well already? She only started like the beginning of the year. So, yeah, she's doing well because she is going to play a whole song in September. So she won't play to my mom or to us now. My mom is actually, um, I just want to tell my mom something. I'm going to tell you first, then I'll talk to my mom. <coughs> um, she must listen. No, I can't tell you first. Wait, I'll talk. To, no, it's rude. Wait, just hold on. Mommy moet sit and luister in die dag as sy oefen. Want sy, sy wil nie voor jou speel as sy nie jou liekie nie. Right. So ma, ma, ma moet die, sy speel in die dag na kamer. Ma kan het hoor. Ek sal ma sê, ek dink ma, as sy oefen gaan vir ma sê, luister of gaan gauwe. Okay. Okay. okay, so my mom's, because Abby wants to play when she can play. But what I say to her, the way I, I listen is, she practices and you can hear it. And she will practice while my mom's here. So I'll just, I, I say to my mom, she must listen. We must put TVs off and stuff off when she practice. She puts her amp very low and then she practice. Then you can hear she plays. She's very cute. And she's very cool with her electric guitar. Now she's going to have a normal guitar as well. So that is, that's amazing. That's amazing. I'm very proud. Alex also wants to play. So he'll probably borrow one of her guitars to learn. Um, and then he wants a bass guitar. So uh, obviously I can't can't get it's expensive so he must save all the I even told my mom I told his dad 
that he wants Christmas money, birthday money, all the monies he gets, he's setting aside so he can afford his own guitar. And that's, that's super cool. Super, super duper amazing. I think it's going to be nice. Oh, well. well. That was a cool thing to get. Wow. I can't wait to, 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 to hear what's happening there. That's freaking amazing. Love, love, love it. Um, she didn't know, but I didn't want to because I can't remember everything. But my ex-husband, her dad, Abby's dad, could play a little bit guitar. So the other day when we went with Alex now, when the school phoned us and they said no, he got hurt. She was in the car with her guitar. She just came from guitar lessons. So we stopped at her dad's. He's never seen a guitar. And she pulled the guitar out there. And he was like all interested. And he played a few notes for her. Mommy David. Right for a spiel. So he played um, a few notes for her. And she was so impressed that her dad could play a few notes. Oh. So she stood there and her dad was checking her guitar out and it was just beautiful. Very, very beautiful. I feel a bit sorry for Alex because um, you know, I don't know why just, you know, one, <laughs> both shoot. But he's also waiting for some kind of instrument, but it must be guitar based because what they said um, in teaching the guitar lessons, they can't teach him the bass first. He needs to learn on a normal guitar, even if it's, that's why I say, Abby is not, she's not rude, so she'll borrow him a guitar. So then he can take guitar lessons because he must learn a normal guitar to play a bass guitar. So that's, that's amazing. I'm, I'm super happy and stoked. I want to know now what's happening after this. <laughs> Nosy mother. But it's very cute how she first asked me if she can say yes. The mom had seen what they do. Say, "Here's my mic. Come for off. Say, 'For the y'all can see.'" Ma, say, "You funny." Say, "Say myself." The y'all say, "It's very cute, guys, because I don't expect her to come and ask me if, but it's a big gift. She, but that is, um, it's a a father's wife that sent her the message. So I don't know why the need was for me to say yes. I think it's because it's such a big gift that she just wants to know if it's okay if she accepts it. But it's a father and a stepmom, so um, that she should not actually ask me if she can accept stuff from them because uh, that they've got the right to give us stuff and, you know, so, but yeah, I appreciate it. I am recording, guys. They are chasing each other and they're making a noise and they're gonna, she chases him and he's on his crutches, guys. On his crutches, hop along Cassidy, jumping on the one leg, and he should be quiet on the leg. He's quiet on the one, but now he thinks the other one is not so he can jump around on it. It's the first time he's got so much life since the the um since the accident happened, not the accident, the injury. So I must maybe stop moaning and just. But it's late and he must calm it down. His dad said he must keep that thing. Don't don't hurt it anymore. I know he's not using it, but still. Ah, oh, helicopter momming, right? <laughs> yeah, I can't help it. You know, you worry about them. They, of course, don't have a care in the world. They just carry on. And he was so... It might not work, Alex. Who can I Yeah. Klein snart. Yeah. I'm just telling my mom, is she hearing them carrying on? She's like, yes. <laughs> my mom says, a bit later, he's lying with his legs up in the air, <laughs> screaming of pain again. You know, kids. <laughs> well, me and I must take care. Hey, kids, you know. <laughs> Oh my god. What's it, mommy? What can you next see, Nivant? When you have mommy, that's see. Yeah, it's what you see. Yeah, no, my mom's talking about something she said, but that I won't say over here. 
She had a big fright and she uttered a word that's not so nice. <laughs> yeah, no. It happens, right? It happens. We had such a big laugh. Yeah? Did they answer you? Did they answer you? What did they say? Show me. Show me. I'll text you. Okay, show me. Thank you. She's very happy. She's very, very happy. All the instruments. I must actually... Um, their rooms are not that big, that big, but at least they've got their own rooms, right? But um, I must get her this hooks. They sell them at Timu. It's hooks that you attach to the wall, but it's very sturdy. And then you hang your guitars against your wall. Because at the moment, um, they can be bumped over on a floor. So I must actually make a plan for her because she's going to have two guitars now. And that's super duper amazing. Very, very amazing. It's just sad that Alex is not getting one. But um, yeah, we, we will sort that out. Help him somehow, or I don't know. I don't know, but somehow. I like to be fair, guys. That's if I do for one, I do for both. I don't. So I don't like when when the one sits and watch. It's not nice. At all. Today, I quite had a shock of my life. You guys know, mommy would know you were, where? Mommy? Mm -hmm. Mommy would know you were. Okay, I'm going to tell you one more time, that makes me understand. So, I'm just telling my mom she must listen. I forgot to tell her. I had the shock of my life today. You guys know that Alex didn't tell me he does not want to be a politician anymore. My mom's shocked because he's always wanted to be one. The, the people in um, the rooms ask him what does he want to be. And I said politician and then he said to me, sorry mom but I haven't spoken to you yet. I don't want to anymore. He wants to become a psychiatrist. I'm going to do doctors, yeah. So Alex changes, he's going to do doctor's side like his dad. He's becoming a psychiatrist. And Abby is also wanting to become something like that. He changed his career that he always wanted to do. And and I said to him, when did he do this? He said the boss that he was at school and stuff. He wants to go to techies or wherever. And he wants to become a psychiatrist, a psychiater. That's, that's what he wants to work with, with people with uh, mental issues and... And bias yeah, I was biased, yeah, well. I'm so I was shocked, guys, but I'm very happy because I think it's a better career than a politician. So Alex changed it, and um, he didn't have a chance to speak to me about it. And today, when people were busy, they asked him, and they, he said, "No, he changed, and and he he actually wants to become a psychiatrist." And then they asked Abby, and she she wants to become. Um, she she doesn't know what it, but it's all a brain doctor or a, so she's still small. She's still so so both of them are gonna go the way their father went um, medical. Both of them wants to study med, um, in the medical thing now. I thought Alex will change as he gets older, and then um, in the beginning of the year, if he's, when he's still stuck to it, I thought oh he's gonna become a politician. And then just suddenly, no, um, no, I'm becoming a psychiatrist. How amazing is that? That's quite a nice one. I, I like that. Because there is, you know, it's, it's for me, it's a better, better thing than a politician. So I don't know. Come on, with that, Glo. I can't do it. 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 He wants to help people with mental issues and he wants to study people that, that, that's got issues like that and he wants to study that illnesses and, and brain dysfunctions and stuff like that. Nice. Yeah, that was quite interesting. 
very very interesting to to hear very and i haven't told his dad yet his dad's gonna be so proud because his dad studied hard to become a doctor and then he is he also he, his dad is not he's not just a doctor he did mba he did a few degrees so his dad is super clever but yes tell me what you guys think of that it's quite nice and interesting oh i was shocked happy shocked because I didn't want to demotivate. Because if he wants to be a politician, let him be one. But it's not something. And it was quite weird that he wants to become that. Because we don't have politicians in our family at all. So yeah. Nice surprise. Nice, nice, nice surprise. There you go. Just looking. Um... There's red, little bit red there left. Because now I've got, if I'm done with this one, do you guys know that I've got probably one string of red, dark red, um, not dark red, it's like maroon. Circles left, then I'm done with it. Done and dusted. Every time I finish a color now, it's for the last time on this canvas. Because I am finishing Ambilight, guys. I haven't done it yet, but I can 100% guarantee you I will do it very, very soon. All right. Yeah, I, I was thinking about Abby and Alex. I'm so proud of them. Ah, uh, well, I must make a plan for Alex now because he also needs a guitar. I'm also musical. I play piano and flute. My mom and dad made sure they got me to classes when I was younger. So I had dancing lessons, I had piano, I had flute. I had all the things, but I was very sporty. Very, very sporty. Um, not anymore. I sport now. I break my legs with my flippin' big ass. <laughs> so we can't Oh, okay. So my so mom... So Oh, yeah, okay, so my mom's spoiling the, spoiling, spilling the beans, spoiling the beans, oh my word. She's telling you that what, what I, what I actually am from heart. I studied, but I'm an artist. Uh, I paint, oil paintings. Uh, a lot of you have seen them. <laughs> um, yeah, and Abby got that from me too, and I got it from my mom, because my mom draws and she never painted like that because she she did who quite money. Who quite money with her Suzuki? Okay, and at that time my mom was a housewife. My dad was very strict. Blah blah blah. Long story short, she didn't. But I actually went very deep into oil painting, charcoal drawing, but naturally, I didn't go for classes how to. I just did it. And then I refined my skills with artists that's good. And I went to visit artists that that I can just build myself up and learn from them, not take away my natural um, painting and drawing talent. But yeah, I've got beautiful things. My favorite thing to, to paint is the ocean. And it's realism. Not it, I paint realism and portraits. So yes... Do you know something else of me if you want to do? Some of you do know that about me. Okay, so this is going to be it for tonight. Hey, mommy. Say bye-bye. Bye-bye, sweet dreams. Okay, you understand that. She said bye-bye, sweet dreams. Well, she doesn't know. A lot of you are sitting in the morning at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> so, wherever you are in the world... In the morning, in the evening, in the afternoon. My mom says, we, whichever time it is, have sweet dreams. <laughs> and I will speak to you tomorrow. Lots of love. Stitcherella. <laughs> <laughs>